In the evening, Jesus was at the table with the twelve followers. They were all eating. Then Jesus said, Believe me when I say that one of you twelve here will hand me over to my enemies. Then Judas, the very one who would hand him over, said to Jesus, Teacher, surely I am not the one you are talking about, am I? Jesus answered, Yes, it is you. While they were eating, Jesus took some bread and thanked God for it. He broke off some pieces and gave them to his followers and said, Take this bread and eat it. It is my body. Then he took a cup of wine, thanked God for it and gave it to them. He said, Each one of you drink some of it. This wine is my blood, which will be poured out to forgive the sins of many and begin the new agreement from God to his people. I want you to know I will not drink this wine again until the day, that day when we are together in my father's kingdom and the wine is new. Then I will drink it again with you. Then they went out to the Mount of Olives. Then Jesus went with his followers to a place called Gethsemane. He said to them, Sit here while I go there and pray. He told Peter and the two sons of Zebedee to come with him. Then he began to be very sad and troubled. Jesus said to Peter and the two sons of Zebedee, My heart is so heavy with grief. I feel as if I am dying. Wait here and stay awake with me. Then Jesus went on a little farther away from them. He fell to the ground and prayed. My father, if it is possible, don't make me drink from this cup, but do what you want, not what I want. Then he went back to his followers and found them sleeping. He said to Peter, Can you men not stay awake with me for one hour? Stay awake and pray for strength against temptation. Your spirit wants to do what is right, but your body is weak. Then Jesus went away a second time and prayed. My father, if I must do this and it is not possible for me to escape it, then I pray that what you want will be done. Then he went back to his followers. Again he found them sleeping. They could not stay awake. So he left them and went away one more time and prayed. This third time he prayed, he said the same thing. And then Jesus went back to his followers and said, Are you still sleeping and resting? The time has come for the Son of Man to be handed over to to the control of sinful men. Stand up, we must go. Here comes the one who will hand me over. While Jesus was still speaking, Judas, one of the twelve apostles, came there. He had a big crowd of people with him, all carrying swords and clubs. They had been sent from the leading priests and the older leaders of the people. Then the men came and grabbed Jesus and arrested him. They led him to the house of Caiaphas, the high priest, the teachers of the law and the older Jewish leaders were gathered there.